Hello, welcome to my kitchen counter. Today I have a question, in fact two questions, two mathematical questions about slicing a roll of paper, hence doing it in the kitchen. So here goes, here's what my questions are. Here's a roll of wrapping paper. It's wrapped around a tube, a nice cylindrical tube that really is a circle at the end. Hopefully I'm putting the right angle for you. That's a circle. And what I'm going to do is slice this tube of paper. Here's my green cutting board, but I'm not, slice, I'm not going to slice orthogonal to the cylinder. I'm going to slice at an angle. Here goes. Uh, let me get the ends maybe a little more manageable because the ends are going to be tricky. All right. Slicing at an angle. Slicing all the way through the tube. Trying to get all the way through the paper too. There, I think I've done it. And lo and behold, I get a shape. That shape there is no longer a circle. It's a squished circle. It's an oval shape. Now, of course, every oval shape we study in high school mathematics is an ellipse. My question is, is this truly an ellipse? You know, if there are some shapes in, in the world that aren't what we expect them to be. For example, the hanging chain looks like a parabola, but it's not a parabola. So just because this looks like an ellipse doesn't mean it is one. Mathematical question number one, is this or is this not an ellipse? Second question is actually a much more exciting one. Let me just push some things out of the way. Let me unroll the paper. And look what we get. We get a beautiful wavy shape. Now my question is, every wavy shape we studied in high school mathematics is a sine curve, a trigonometry curve, or a cosine curve, which is a sine curve off by 90 degrees. So my question is, just because this looks like a sine curve, is it one? Is this actually a trigonometric curve we're seeing right here in wrapping paper? So there are my two questions. In slicing an ellipse, this is slicing a, sorry, a cylinder of wrapping paper at an angle, do I get an ellipse? And do I get a sine curve? So I'm going to answer these questions in my 2015 February cool math essay. I'll put the link up as I speak. And um, have a look there if you want to get the answers to these questions. It's kind of cool. Are we seeing ellipses? Are we seeing sine curves? Beautiful stuff. Thanks so much.